The trolley problem is a classic ethical dilemma that asks what you would do if you had to choose. Between saving five people or one person from a runaway trolley, would you pull a lever to divert the trolley to a different track? Where it would kill one person instead of five? Or would you do nothing and let the trolley kill the five people on the main track? This hypothetical scenario has become more relevant in the age of self-driving cars, which may face similar situations on the road. How should a self-driving car decide who to save or sacrifice in a crash? Should it prioritize the passengers, pedestrians, or other drivers? What factors should it consider, such as age, health, or legal responsibility? These are not easy questions to answer, and there is no consensus among ethicists, engineers, or the public. Some argue that self-driving cars should follow a utilitarian approach, which aims to maximize the overall good and minimize the overall harm. Others argue that self-driving cars should follow a deontological approach, which focuses on the moral duty and rights of each individual. Still others argue that self-driving cars should follow a virtue ethics approach, which considers the character and values of the agent.